Joel Buono, nowhere to go, taken down by Trey Flowers, the SEC's active leader in tackles for loss. And Trey Flowers is the guy up front that they're going to have to handle. You can see him coming off the left edge, unblocked because he beat the point of scrimmage right there. They'll run it again. Buono again runs into a roadblock, tackled by Brooks Ellis, the middle linebacker. On the ground again, Stingley to the perimeter, and he's tackled for no gain, Arkansas football. Again, Buono goes in motion. Hare under pressure. The ball comes loose. Arkansas picks it up, a scoop and a score. Darius Phylon, and it's 13-0 Razorbacks. Four, and it results in a defensive touchdown. They play games up front. Flowers is right here, is going to go inside, and Phylon is out here, and he's actually going to run outside. And they meet at the quarterback. One hits the quarterback, knocks the ball loose, and then... Flowers is there to clean up, right there. Games up inside with very athletic, powerful defensive linemen worked well. He's absolutely worn out the opposing defense. Drew Hare was looking for somebody to hand the ball off to. Nobody was there, and he's tackled by Trey Flowers right at the line of scrimmage. Running back goes the wrong way. This is supposed to be a quarterback read, but where's the running back? Fake the fly sweep, and no running back to fake it to. And then Trey Flowers just knows what to do. Here's Buono. Gets to the line of scrimmage, maybe get a yard, and it's third down and nine. And you see NIU early in this. The start the Huskies wanted on their first drive of the second half. Hare on third and long. And he underthrew Breskis in, so three and out for Northern Illinois. And to Anthony Maddie. Maybe looking for a spark. Maddie will keep it on the read option. And he's tackled right at the line of scrimmage. Flowers led the pursuit for Ark. I like that idea. Maddie, the Western Michigan transfer. Gets right back to the line of scrimmage. And another three and out for NIU.